There we go. I got a fish. Doesn't look like a big fish, but I'll take it, man. What's up, Survivor Fanatics? Thank you very much for hanging out with me today. This is KG48, and we're back with subsistence. All right, guys, I'm just out here. Get you know what? I got an arrow. Let's try and get this. Let's try and get this rabbit. Here we go. Uh, where is he? There he is. Okay. Nope. And it broke the arrow too. If you hear the crunch sound, the arrow broke, and you can't get it back. That's a bummer. It's going to take some time to get my uh, aim down with the thing. It's not easy. There's no crosshairs. It's very difficult. So it's going to take a little bit of time to get that down. It sucks because every time I use an arrow and miss, it takes some nails. So there's a lot of nails right there. That's pretty cool. Um, I actually went on the uh, Discord for subsistence. And I don't know if you, I don't know what you guys are going to tell me about it, traps and stuff. I'm going to hold off on the traps because I look, I did some research into them. They don't sound overly useful. And I went on the discord and they said, yeah, the traps are, I mean, that's eight wood right there and four cordage. And people say the traps, a, a couple of people on the discord told me the traps aren't worth it. Um, I'm going to mess around with the traps eventually, but I want to get, um, uh, somewhat situated in the game, uh, before I go doing traps. I'm also going to make some arrows. Um, I'll just make two. I need arrows. I'm going to need the food. I got no choice. Um, and what we really need to do is make a fishing pole. Fishing pole is what we really need. You might be saying, well, just eat the grubs, right? The grubs do give you protein. It's true. But four protein is almost nothing. And I think that would be much better used um, to catch fish. I can get fish oil and protein that way. And that should hold me up until I can get some. I do need to kill four rabbits or loot uh, cloth. I haven't looted any cloth yet, I don't think. Um, have I? I'm not seeing any. Yeah, I haven't looted any cloth yet. So, uh, by the way, I caught a chicken um, in between videos. Um, I haven't looted any cloth yet. So, that's going to be a problem. I'm going to have to kill, you know... I'm going to have to kill uh, four rabbits probably to get the cloth I need to make the shotgun. Once I get the shotgun, everything opens up to me. Uh, when I get the shotgun, the threats go from animals to hunters, you know? Uh, so, that's what I'm looking for right now. Just going to kind of... Look around the countryside. I need what I really need right now is cordage um, for the uh, the good old fishing pole. And um, nails would always be good so I can expand the base. I think the first thing. Oh no! Uh, well, yeah, I need to make the um, the wood burner. And again, I can't make the wood burner without um, cloth. And I need to kill some rabbits. I could probably kill a wolf with the pistol. Maybe I should do that. Maybe I should do that. Mm. Yeah, honestly, I probably should. All right, I got like no stamina left. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and cut down some trees. Uh, well, I get that stamina back. And I think we're probably going to go back. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go back because I want to I want to see if um, the fire's still burning. And um, if it is, I'd like to get... To Actually, I should probably go back right now. I really don't, I really don't want to have to waste fire starting material in that fire. And it does go out... Um, it does go out pretty quick. So let's get back to base. Okay, we got another rabbit here. He's not in a good position to shoot because he's kind of below me. But I'm going to see if I can get him anyway. I could really use this. That felt way short, didn't it? Didn't break, though. All right, so we got the arrow back. All right, so um, the arrow drop is what's uh, what's causing me issues here. So you need to be aware of that. I'm pretty sure I can kill a wolf with the, with the bow and the pistol. I can hit him with the bow from far away as he comes in. A level one wolf. I could probably light him up with the pistol. Um, oh, there's another rabbit. Hold on. Two more rabbits. Okay. All right, remember the arrow drop. Come on, stop moving. Ooh, nice. All right, you can, you, you can go away. I got this guy. He's alive, by the way. Um, you can domesticate animals. <laughs> so, yes, you can domesticate animals. I don't understand the survival games that don't let you domesticate animals. It's such a cool part of, like, survival. Um, I guess it can make things too easy, easy sometimes, but... I don't know. And I think the animals will chase you into the water, so don't think you're getting away from anything by coming in the water. But my fire is burning. I've got two animals to cook. I've got my first thing of cloth, hopefully. I think the rabbits give you cloth every time. We'll see. Um, not really 100% on that, but you know we'll kind of have to see about that. And uh, let's get on up here. And come on, come on, come on. All right. Split half, split half. Oops. No, he don't cook wood, bro. There you go. All right, cool. So we're going to kill you. Kill you. Butcher. 
Yep, one piece of cloth. Hell yeah. Now here's the thing. Do I want to use the cloth for the shotgun or the wood-burning stove? Honestly, I'm going to use it for the wood-burning stove. Yeah, I think that's most important. Because the wood-burning stove lasts so much, so much longer than this, this thing. Um, so we still need some more cordage. And that will be just enough cordage for a fishing pole. Now we're going to have to start worrying about our fruits and vegetables. So, yeah. Um, since I'm not using this stuff for traps, I could eat it. Um, I don't know the potatoes. So these can go bad, I think. So I don't know when to eat these. Should I eat those? Can be eaten raw for uh, better use in cooking recipes. I'm not going to be using these any cooking recipes anytime soon, so I'm just going to eat these. Because I'm pretty sure they... I'm pretty sure the potatoes can go bad, although I could be wrong about that, but... You know, who knows? Yeah, this is going to be real good. And then I can start fishing. Man, that, that food doesn't go that far. But, you know, what are you going to do? We need to keep those grubs coming in. Oh, there's another chicken over there to the left. All right, we're going to try and grab that chicken. Oh, you know what? Hold on. I've got a um, I've got a case over here I think I'd like to get more. Yeah, there we go. Get out of here, wolf. All right, so the animals are starting to have a little bit of, uh, a little bit of mercy on my soul, which is great. We'll grab this while we're out here. Okay. All right, cool. And uh, let's go over here and try and grab that chicken. I, I stoked that fire up real good, put a lot of wood into it. Um, we're going to have to get through those big trees again. Oh, I didn't see it was right here. All right, let's see if we can get them. Keep a lookout for the animals. Wow. The chickens have been off their game, cold games. <laughs> they are not running me into animals anymore. Thank you. Thank you. All right, I'm going to go for some big trees. I'm going to go for big trees. Big wood, try and avoid trouble, and um, thought I heard something like growling just in my mind. Yeah, we need a lot more cordage, too. We're out of cordage, and we're gonna need a lot of it, so let's just be careful here. Okay, looks okay. Like I said, I want to hit these big trees, I want to have a lot of grubs, I want to have a lot of grubs so I can just fish for the whole night. I don't, actually, I don't know how easy fishing is during the night. I think you have to see what you're doing. Maybe I should fish during the day. Oh, hold on. We got a rabbit here. Damn it. At least it didn't break. Yeah. If they don't break, you know, no harm, no foul. Okay, we got a chest over here. All right. And let's see what you got. Mm -hmm. A lot of, um, those are like, uh, ammo casings. Yeah, you can make ammo in this game. This game has a lot of building, a lot of cool stuff to it. It's just, um, it's a little slow in the early game, you know? Like, it's, uh, it's a little grindy. Like, um, I'd like to see him speed up the early game a little bit, maybe. I don't know how he would do it, but I'd like the early game to be sped up because every time I play this game, it takes me, like, ages just to get to the, like, the cool parts, you know? Not that this isn't cool. This is, I mean... This is pretty cool. I mean, this is like hardcore, real survival type thing. So, I guess that is pretty... That's pretty dope. Oh my god, this is killing me. Why is that... First of all, why is that bear not mauling that deer? Like, if that bear was in there, I could try and get that deer. Um, Well, first of all, why is he not mauling the deer? Second of all, if he wasn't there, I could try and get the deer. That sucks. Alright, we got a rabbit over here. So, let's wait for him to stop. Got him. Yeah, you just gotta aim high. Just gotta aim high. Um, the rabbits will spoil even if you don't butcher them. I think there's a, there's a time where if like you didn't butcher the rabbit, they'd like last forever or something. But I don't think that's the case anymore. That's gonna be uh, cloth number two. If I can get three cloth, I can make myself the um, the wood burning stove, which would just be so fantastic. I should probably head back to base too, though. But this is um, I think that campfire is gonna last for a good amount longer. And this is important stuff over here. I should be able to find some good stuff over here. I need cordage, by the way. Um, in order to fish, you need tackle. In order to make tackle, you need uh, cordage. Oh, there's a chicken. I don't feel safe running in that direction, though. I don't know what's over there. But we'll see. If he's still there when I loot this thing, I'll, I'll chase him. Nope, he's gone. Yeah, forget it. Yeah, coming up on like a, a hill when you don't know what's over it is very dangerous. You want to do it slowly. And you don't chase chickens slowly, right? So, yeah. It's kind of scary. It's kind of scary. Need some foundations, man. I'm sick of running through the water to get to my base. 
Yeah, I think I'm going to need at least... Uh, I'm going to need quite a few foundations. And I don't know if you could build down with stairs either. That's going to be a problem. Um, but if I get enough foundations, I could probably build out into the water. Yeah, I could do that. Because um, the foundations that are coming uh, out from the middle of the water where I'm, like, starting my base, um, they're really high. So I'd have to, like, build down. I don't know if you can have stairs going down. You might be able to have stairs going down. I don't know. In a lot of games, you can't. Like, you have a foundation, and then you can't put stairs, like, going down. The stairs have to be, like, you know, in a certain spot. It's kind of weird. Um, the building in this game is really fantastic, though. I, I feel like... Oh, protein bar. I feel like Cold Games really goes out of his way um, to make us builders happy, and that means a lot to me. It really does. I know I saw a wolf up here. Oh, nice. And a splint to boot. Good thing I never break my leg in any game I play. All right, let's get back to base. So I was right over there, and I was like, let me get back to base. So I was going to walk all the way around to avoid the bears and wolves to get back to base. And I was like, let's just go for a swim, man. You know, it's quicker, it's more direct, we can grab some kelp on the way, why not? Right? Why the heck not? Nope, there's some more kelp. Be careful how how far you dive down. You can run out of oxygen very quickly. And I doubt this game is, uh... <laughs> I doubt this game is forgiving for you running out of oxygen. Doesn't seem like, um... Doesn't seem like it would be, right? Yeah, this is gonna be a cool base, actually. Now that I'm thinking about it, I could just build... Right out from here up to here, and then this will be the main part of my base. Yeah, this is this is this was a good idea. I'm glad I was kind of forced to do it because I wasn't going to. Uh, split. Um, damn it! I keep putting the cook spot. All right, so we need a lot more wood. But first things first, let's butcher. Butcher. Oh yeah, there we go. We got two cloth. One more cloth, and we can make the wood burning stove. And I do have some tackle here. Let's go ahead and make some of these. And then we're going to make some more tackle. I'm definitely going to fish during the night. I don't know what I want to eat first. Blueberries? You can use this stuff as bait in the um, in the traps. But like I said, people said the traps aren't worth it. Plus, right now, I kind of need carbohydrates. So, you know, using this to catch protein is probably not the, the way, you know, I want to do things. All right. Food's looking pretty decent. This is the best my food's looked in a long time. Can I make another foundation? No, because I need more. Oh, I can make two more foundations if I get the wood and cordage. All right, cool. Well, we're going to have to get some wood because um, that fire is not looking too good. So we probably won't be able to make any foundations anytime soon. But um, I wonder if I could bring that foundation right out here. It would come right over here and line up here. It would come right out to here and line up right about here. Actually, maybe. I might be able to do that. I don't know. I'm going to have to see how things go. I will not know for sure until the time comes. Um, the sun is starting to go down, so we can't go too far. Um, but I, I need to get a good amount of wood. At least three trees worth of wood. So let's be careful here, because I do see some cordage. Well, some future cordage. And let's go ahead and grab some wood, because it's going to be dark soon. And, um, yeah, we really need, uh, we really need that wood-burning stove. One more, one more rabbit, we got it. I think we'll have a wood-burning stove for tomorrow night. And then once the wood-burning stove is done, our next priority is to build a walkway over there with foundations. And, um, honestly, it's funny. Like, I have the nails, like, for a couple of foundations. I just don't have the freaking cordage, man. Cordage is used for everything. So I'm gonna have to keep a lookout for cordage. I mean, cordage is a lot easier to get than nails. But, you know. And nails are gonna go quick. I still have a storage chest. So, that's a problem. Maybe I should make a storage chest. I don't think you need cordage for the storage chest. Oh, we got another rabbit over there. Hold on. Hold everything. Hold up. Shit, he saw me. Son of a bitch. Where'd he go? Yeah, this might be worth this might be worth the chase. Yeah, he's gonna stop right there. I don't see any anything else in the area. Damn it! Wasn't sure if I was aiming high. He wouldn't stop moving and he was moving towards me. Which means I was going to have to take the shot pretty soon. Or he's going to see me. I'm going to go for him. I probably have enough wood to get me through the night. Yes! And that, my friends, might be a wood burning stove tonight. And that, my friends, is a wolf. <laughs> I'm getting the hell out of here. Alright, I'm going to chop down trees for the rest of the time. 
And um, hopefully, I, I hope we have what I need. For, I hope we have what I need for the wood burning stove. I don't think it needs wood. I don't think it needs cordage. I mean, I probably have everything I need for it, but I don't know for sure. Now you gotta watch out because if that wolf did spot me, he will walk in my direction. Yep. Yep. If, if, if remember, guys, it's very important you understand. If an animal senses you, they will make their way towards you. They will. What the fuck was that? I'm really starting to freak myself out now. Um, they will stalk you. So, you know, don't think, oh, you know, that wolf's not attacking me, so I'm just going to turn my back on him and blah, blah, blah. That's not going to work. All right, hold on. We got another rabbit here. Damn, man. I'm on fire, bro. Losing a lot of arrows, but whatever. That's what they're for. I mean, they are specifically for killing rabbits. They're not going to do enough to the, um, to the big game, so. Uh, all right. Oh, yeah, we got 18. We got 18 wood. We're good to go cool very cool i'm not going to start putting down foundations though until i get enough so i'm thinking i may want to make about three or four foundations then i'm going to start building a f like something out here maybe i'll make some stairs as well because i'm kind of curious how the stairs are going to work all right i'm not going to put too much in here because i might have enough do i have enough no i need more oh, i don't need scrap metal i can't make scrap metal i can make this wood i can't make the scrap metal wait Oh yeah, I didn't I didn't kill the other uh, rabbit. Butcher. There we go. We got that. All right, so we're not going to get it tonight, unfortunately, but we will we will um have a wood burning stove for tomorrow night. I keep on of the metal. Usually you have the metal. Metal is not usually a problem. It's kind of crazy. You can make a light. I'm not going to waste metal on any of this stuff though because um I really need that wood burning stove. That's number 1. And look at some of this stuff. We got a lathe, a diving station, air conditioner, large storage unit. Speaking of storage, can I make, um, first of all, let's uh, go ahead and put some wood in here. And let's go ahead and cook this up. Uh, can I just drop both these in there? Nope. Just does one at a time. That's fine. Let's go ahead and cook those up and eat those. And then uh, once those are cooked up, I'm probably going to try some fishing. Although I'm kind of worried that fishing, you kind of need to see in into the water. So that, that could be a problem. And um, another thing we're going to have to start thinking about is this right here, a plant bed. As a matter of fact, the plant bed might actually be more important than the wood burner. But I'm going to make the wood burner first because I want the wood burner. I can't believe we're out of metal. Like, I don't usually have problems with metal. That's kind of that's kind of crazy. All right, guys. I just tried to fish through the night. Um, the first two times I fished, uh, I, I struck and it said I failed, lost my tackle. The third time nothing happened and I lost my tackle. So I'm going to try one time on video and if you guys can tell me what I'm doing wrong or how to do this better, um, by all means let me know because I need to be able to fish, um, successfully. So there we go. Also you got to watch out for bleeding. Like, um, when you go to butcher something, you get its blood all over you and, um, you have to wash yourself off or you could get sick. Just see it now. Um, all right, here we go. So I come over here, <clears throat> I right click, left click. It says strike and reel in. So I'm assuming when you see the little bobble out there, like going bloop, 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 then you got to strike and that's like hooks the fish, right? Um, let me know if I'm doing this too late, too early or whatever, um, because I do need to learn to fish. All right, so that was one. I'm going to wait for a second one. Oh, there we go. Fish hooked. Beautiful. Okay, well, there you go. You got to wait, all right? The first one is that first little bloop out there. I was re I was um, striking at that point, but you got to wait for the second one where the fish really pulls the hook under. Okay, cool. It looks like the fish is kind of blinking, doesn't it? <clears throat> all right. Now, I got to go down there and grab it, right? Come on. Come on, grab it. There we go. I got a fish. Doesn't look like a big fish, but I'll take it, man. Hell yeah. It's freaking cool. Okay, great. So, any other tips are great, too, but I, I think I kind of got it there. Um, small fish. All right. Give a small amount of protein. All right, I think we're good to go. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and do some looting, man. What are we looking for? Oh, uh, we're looking for metal. Yeah, we're looking for metal. Now, is there any animals over there? I'm going to kind of swim over here and see, because there is a chest. Let's see if there's any animals over here. I'm not seeing any. I, mean, I see a wolf over there. But I'm not seeing the big bear that was here last night. All right, so there's a wolf over there as well. Oh, there he is. Okay, hold on. All right. Okay, shh. 
I need to be able to listen. It's really important that I listen for the growls. All right, so there's another wolf right there. Come over here. Uh, yeah, I need metal. I can't believe how much I need metal. It's crazy. It's never. It's not usually the case. I'm guessing he's always balancing the game, you know. There he is. I can see his hit points. Get out of there. Get out of there, Cage. Don't be a hero. Okay. It's, it's so hard to do commentary in this game because I kind of have to be quiet, you know? Um, it's nuts. It's freaking nuts. Alright, well, I'm not going to chop any wood until I need the stamina. Well, no, I'll chop this one. I could use the grubs now that I know how to fish properly. Yeah, so the like usually the, the first the first little bloop is like a, a nibble, you know, and if you strike too early, you lose it. Um, so yeah, that's cool. So wait for the wait for the the bobber to actually go underwater. You'll, so yeah, I think I could do a little. I think I could do better from now on now that I know how to do it. I figured I was doing it wrong because when I lost my when I lost my um my tackle a lot, I was like, I don't remember this being this difficult. Like I remember like catching fish was, you know, very doable, you know, but. I just have to relearn it, that's all. Is that a rabbit or a chicken? I think that's a rabbit. Freaking bear. Yeah, it's a rabbit. I'm gonna leave that rabbit alone for the time being. So I need this wood. I really need wood. I need it badly. I need the wood bad, bro. Just go ahead and turn all that into planks. Come on. Come on. That's right, bear. You turn around. Nope. Don't turn around and stop. Nope. Don't come back here. He heard me talking shit. That's what it was. He's like, oh, really? You think I got to turn around? Maybe you got to turn around. I'm a freaking thousand pound bear. Are bears a thousand pounds? I don't know. I'm a 900 pound bear. You're a little puny human. You don't tell me to walk away. You walk away. You know, it's really good that bears, like, don't have attitude problems or we'd be in trouble. Like, we'd be bowing down to our, our, our bear overlords as I speak. Okay, so... I could probably let that fire burn out tonight. Well, not if I don't get the metal. I really need the metal. Did I get any? How much metal do I need? I think I need like seven. God, I can't believe I got any metal yet. What the hell, bro? Come on, cold games. What are you doing to me, man? Where is the metal? Where is the metal? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Grab this tree too. Not seeing a lot of stuff on the ground. Like, I mean, I'm seeing a decent amount of chests. I'm not seeing a lot of metal. I saw a lot the first day, but then not so much since then. How much wood do I have? Yeah, let's just do that. Boom, Pikachu. There we go. Man, I, I really need um cordage too. I'm probably running by a lot of cordage. The metal. I don't think it's around a lot. I think the cordage, though, I'm running by it quite often because I'm so paranoid. I gotta start remembering to look for the for the cordage. Look for the cordage, Cage. Look for the cordage. Look for it. This is a good spot over here. I used to live in this area back in the day. My last major Let's Play of this game, when I when I got into Endgame and built a really big compound, it was in this area. Ooh, there we go, a couple metal. We just need one more. One more, baby. I think I'm gonna stay out for the rest of the day, though. Even if um, even when I get everything I need, because uh, I'll let that fire burn out. We're gonna load up on resources today. How are my stats doing? Okay, we're gonna go ahead and eat that, drink that, and eat one of the. Nah, just eat two. You could use kelp for other things as well. So I gotta remember to keep uh, keep farming up the kelp. Ooh. There we go. Okay. <laughs> That's really a cool map transition, dude. No joke. It's like I made a drone or something. Ooh, that could have been a way to like see from the sky. Let us make drones. Nah, shut up, Cage. I want maps early game. And that would take for take a year to get to making a drone. All right, looking okay. This isn't really the way I wanted to come, but this is a new type area, so why not? Okay. Ooh, a match, nice. 
that's actually going to help out. Uh, yeah, let's go for it. Watch out for the wolves and the bears. Watch out for the wolves and the bears. He's going to lead you to a wolf or a bear and laugh at you as you die. Okay. Nice. Led me to a chest. Maybe I'm not giving the, um, the chickens the respect they deserve. I mean, he led me to a chest. Here I'm talking shit about him. Call him a scumbag and a and a turncoat or I don't know. I was thinking that stuff. I didn't really say it, but and the guy leads me to a chest and he's gonna be in my belly tonight. So get off the get off the chicken's case, man. <laughs> he's just trying to live. How dare he not want to get eaten? Man, I'm getting a lot of nails. That is freaking dope. That is dope as hell. That's another good place. Oh, I I recognize that area. I built there too. I built in those rocks too. And that'll be the last piece of metal I need. Alright. Hold on there. Alright, cool. You know what? I do think I'm gonna get away from that wolf and then I'm gonna call the video. <laughs> I wanna I wanna dive in this uh this lake over here next episode for kelp. I hate being interrupted to answer my phone in real life and then have it's a telemarketer. It drives me nuts. God, I hate that. Let me get a freaking video here, dude. Alright, let's dive for some kelp, then I'm gonna call this one. There we go. Got to be careful because if there is animals near the edge here, you could be in some trouble. But I'm not really seeing anything right now. So I'm just going to go for some kelp. And I think we're going to call this one. Um, yeah, next video I'm just going to spend the rest of my day out collecting stuff. And then we're going to make that um, wood-burning stove. And, uh, you know, things are, things are coming up cage. They're looking good. They are looking good. All right, guys, if you haven't been enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. And I'm going to be a little bit nervous here. Because coming out of that water, oof. I don't know why, man. That always makes me nervous. By the way, this little valley right here is a great place to, to get loot. Really good place. Freaking wolf. See? That wolf was over there, and he came to the last spot. He saw me, or he sensed me. Yeah, you gotta be careful with that stuff, man. I think I'm joking. Alright, guys. That's the real end of the video. I'll see you next time. Have a good one.